we have our spin art, our spinner art. So this one's a lot of fun. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna mix half of your um, watercolor, um, your watercolor paint um, with two parts water. So this is my two parts water with it. I'm sorry I didn't show you it before. Um, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our pipette. If you've never used these, what you do is before you put it in your liquid, you, you push the top together and you put it in and then you release and it'll add the water. So, but before we put it on here, we're gonna start our spinner. So you hold it down and you give it a really good spin. Oh, that was good. Really good spin and then as it's spinning, you just do little drops. Um, on this can spread past your paper, um, but the, the, you don't want to do it too much too quick or else it'll start to pool. So you just want to kind of give it a little bit at a time and it'll continue to do that. And then what you can do is once it's, you can move it, like you can move it over here and do one of your other colors. Right now I just have this color going, so I'm going to keep going with it. Um, and so it'll spin over here. The cool thing is when you do a second color is it'll, um, it'll add that second color into your other one. So again, the key is really light little drops um, and not too much at once or else it'll start to pool and it'll get too heavy and you'll kind of miss. You won't see your splatters anymore because it'll just pool. Um, but then you just have to let it dry. So I recommend one, doing this outside if you can um, because then one, it'll dry quicker and the sun but two, once it splatters like this, it won't get it all over your mom's nice table. So um, that is spin art. It's very easy, it's a lot of fun. And then when you're all done, make sure you wash this really, really well. Um, there's written instructions too that walk you through this, but I just wanted to show you just kind of how much to put on at a time so that it doesn't become a big pool. Um, some people want it to be pool because then it becomes like really hazy and kind of modeled, which is fine too, but it's going to take a long time to dry and then sometimes the paper gets too wet. But the paper that you have is watercolor paper, so it can hold a lot of a lot of wetness, um, but it can still get oversaturated sometimes. So that is spin art. Happy crafting!